okay hi guys so i just got home from picking up the car from getting the work done but they actually forgot to do the ceiling so when i showed you guys like the fabric that was hanging down from the ceiling of the car they forgot to do that so i'm gonna have to bring it back another time so that they can do that and um they did put the antenna back on though so that's nice because now I'm going to be able to listen to my Sirius XM, the satellite radio, even when it's raining outside or the weather isn't the best. So after I work a little bit at my new job, um, I'm gonna bring the car back in so then they can do the ceiling of the car. And um, tomorrow I have to go do that drug test and physical, like I told you guys. I will try to bring you guys along with me. I've done it in the past. Um, obviously I can't really film like my drug tests and things like that and I'm not going to film like in the waiting room or anything but the occupational health office um, like once I get done with the drug screen and everything I can usually film in there because sometimes it's so like backed up and that's why I want to go as early as I can in the morning um, or as early as I get up just to um, make sure that I don't have like a whole long ass line of people in front of me. And Paul actually gave me a gift card for gas, um, for $25 worth of gas. And that should just about fill up the car. But I drove right past the street where I needed to turn in order to um, get the gas at that gas station. So um, my husband just took the car to put $15 in it at another gas station um so we'll have to do that Eeyore. sorry um but anyways i don't know what i was saying we'll have to do that for but yeah so um i'm standing in front of the space heater right now and wrigley's down here sniffing me because um i was at paul's mom's house and she has a dog and um so they smell the other dog and caesar actually peed all over my shoe because he's been doing this thing where when he gets excited he pees and so now i have pee on my shoe and don't mind all the hair on the floor um that's from wrigley and i need to sweep over here because we when we went hiking we brought in a bot a, a bot a bunch of leaves and dirt and um, never swept it up. So I need to sweep that up. Um, I already swept the other part of the house back here where you can see, I just didn't sweep the front room. So I uh, will talk to you guys in a little bit. So I was gonna ask you guys, um, what is your favorite fall activity to do? Like whether it's just on your own or with your family, there's one thing that I've never really done that I think would be really, really fun. And that's going to like an apple orchard, getting fresh apple cider, and like going to a pumpkin patch. I don't really think even as a child, I don't believe that my mom ever took me to a pumpkin patch. Like we went to pick out like Christmas trees and stuff like that, but I never remember her taking us to a pumpkin patch. I just remember her like getting pumpkins for us and us carving them at home. Like, I don't ever remember going to an actual pumpkin patch. I could be wrong, but I don't remember ever actually going to a pumpkin patch. Um, I think going to an orchard would be really cool. Um, I have gone on like hay rides and stuff like that. I think that's fun. I don't know if they're really doing these sorts of things this year because of the coronavirus and all that crap, but um, I'm just curious like what, other people enjoy for like fall time stuff um i'm really looking for things to do with jacob um because i do go out of my way to try to find stuff to do that's fun that maybe jacob hasn't tried before or even if he has tried it before um just stuff that he would enjoy doing because you know i don't want every weekend that he's with us to just be the same thing sitting at home watching Netflix or YouTube, um, playing video games and stuff like that. Um, we don't have the desktop set up still, so, um, you know, <laughs> he can't really play his Warcraft 
but um, he's kind of grounded from video games right now anyways. But anyways, I'm just curious. And honestly, I think that's going to be the end of today's video because I don't really have much to talk about. Um, like I said, tomorrow I will bring you guys along with me when I go to do the drug test and the physical and or as much as I can I will bring you guys with me obviously you can't watch it like I was saying but um I don't think you'd really want to so yeah I will update you guys I have to get a an instant five panel drug test and a non-DOT physical so um I'm gonna go as early as I can in the morning I'm probably gonna have to set an alarm um just because I want to get it all over and done with and then I can come home and kind of enjoy the weather because tomorrow is supposed to be in the 70s, which is awesome for this time of year. Um, so yeah, and if you see this corner right here, we told the landlord about it, but he hasn't come to fix it yet. There is a wet spot there, if you can see that right here. Um, every time it rains, it gets wet right there and sometimes over here also, but um, yeah, he hasn't had a chance to come fix it yet, so hopefully he'll be able to do that soon. And yeah, once my husband gets home, I'm probably going to have him come with me to take the dogs for a walk before we have dinner because I think they need to kind of get out of the house and exercise a bit. And yeah, so we'll see how it goes. And I hope you guys are enjoying my videos. I've been trying to make them a little less monotonous and more enjoyable for you guys. Um, I know that life can sometimes be monotonous and, you know, I'm sorry if my vlogs get boring sometimes or my videos get boring. Um, it's just my life. I just share whatever I find to be interesting from my life. I share things that I go through on a daily basis with you guys. And so I hope that you guys um, enjoy the content that I'm able to get for you. I know it's not the most interesting or exciting and I don't have the best editing skills, but I really hope that you guys enjoy the effort that I do put in and the things that I am able to create with my channel. And yeah, let me know if there's anything that you wanna see on my channel in the future, um, any topics or specific types of videos, let me know. I will talk to you guys again in my next video.